Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Andrew and today I'm finishing off the season finale of Silo season one. It's been very good so far. Very interesting. A lot of questions. Hopefully they answer a few of the questions this episode. I'm hoping to get a bit more information on the Silo itself and its history. Hopefully I get a bit more information on why they're trying to keep people in the Silo. Even though it seems perfectly fine outside. And I'm thinking there's more than one Silo. And this one might be Silo 18. Because the man's got that thing with 18 on it that keeps going off for some reason. We'll probably find out about that this episode. Maybe there's an outside faction keeping an eye on the silo and what's going on inside it. The silo itself could just be like one massive experiment to see how humans react to certain situations. Could be a bunch of different things, but hopefully we'll get a bit more clarity on what that is and why it was built in the first place. And I'm also interested to see how this season differs from the, how the books end up, if there's any changes at all that was made. But anyway, leave a like and let's get into the episode. Everyone has to see this. Everyone who? Everyone. Is it, would it be possible to get this up on every computer? No. Why not? It, it's not impossible, but all the computer right. screens are controlled by IT. Now you want to break in IT? There are signal boosters every 30 levels. Could project it on um, screens in the dining room. In the mids. There's one on uh, 126. Great, we'll go there. No, wait, wait, there is security. That has already happened once. When the power went out. And he's going to trace it back here. Do you want to stay? Is that true? Yeah. Fuck me. Ah, <laughs> oh, great. Real great. Yeah, uh, he's stuff, dude. Whose apartment? It's assigned to uh, Patrick Kennedy. We need all Raiders to 22, all Raiders to 22. Who's he, a friend of hers? I thought you checked No, he's him. not a friend. There's no way he's getting out of that one. They searched the level. She's not there. She would have been seen on the stairs. So that's how she's been moving around. While well, they keep losing her. Did you find anything that gave you some insight? No. That's a lie. I can't help but notice your hands. You're holding your right and your left. Why is that? Yeah. It seems pretty obvious. Surely they've known for ages about that. A radio carries. She'll be there in five minutes. Oh shit. What? They're linking screens. Oh, that's what they're trying to do. I was wondering what they were doing. Shut your eyes. All of you! Shut your eyes! Shut your eyes! It's too late for that, dude. Faces! Way too late for that. You too, Robert. Okay, so... Sims doesn't even know about it. But he seems to know exactly what it is. It's way too late now. It's, it's over. You gotta go. Let's go. Go, go now. Go now. Go now. Go with him. No, no. We're, hey, hey. We've got the watch. Are you freaking kidding? <laughs> well, they're still after the watch. He's got much bigger problems now. What you have just seen, you will unsee. No, that's not how that works. Are they the only people that seen it? Or do they connect to every computer in the whole silo? Oh, that would definitely kill her if he hit it. What's, what's their plan here? She was that close to the bottom? Okay. I didn't realize she was that close to the bottom. Lucky. Lucky they moved her straight away. Judicial's here. What? Wait, how did they know she was here? I told them. There is nowhere that we could hide her they wouldn't find. Yeah. That would have came straight down here. Uh, before you let him in, I, uh, I need a minute with Walk. I'll try. Maybe she's gonna get sent out this episode. I wouldn't have hurt your family. My son keeps asking if the scary lady is coming back. Well, how many families do you think ask the same about you? Do you know what I do? Rob! Do you? Rob! Hmm. <laughs> Not really. Well, at least I don't know why he does the things he does. They haven't explained that yet. Just that they're keeping people safe somehow. In order to prevent rebellion and severe judicial repercussions for your friends down deep, I need you to just stop saying you didn't ask to go outside and waive your right to a judicial hearing. Yep, 
being sent outside. Hopefully she doesn't put the suit on. I think that's how they're killing him. Unless the outside is really poisonous, which I don't think it is. I think they poison him when they put the suit on. They poison the air in the suit. What's she planning on doing? Gonna die. What did she tell her? Is this about that fucking heat tape? It is. You know that stun of hers brought judicial down. What? What's in the the heat tape for? Your tape is way better than theirs. Yeah, I know. Doesn't make any sense. Unless it does. Okay. Something special about their heat tape? What is this? What, what are we doing here? Mr. Sim. Showing them the security room? I've got a feeling that they're going to kill everybody in that security room that saw that picture. So someone could torture me until I gave up the hard drive and the people I worked with? No, no. They just want to talk to you. No! Not me. He did kill himself, trying to protect her. I was rash when I said I was worried about you being my shadow. Tomorrow when Nichols is out on the hill, we'll have another discussion, okay? Hopefully we'll get some answers out of that one. And in recognition of that, you will not be sent out to clean. You will go to the mines. Ten years. Which is a shame. Ten years in the mines. Uh, I don't think they've actually shown the mines yet. So I don't know what it looks like down there. Or where it is in the silo. But maybe ten years of hauling iron ore will set you straight. Pretty sure it'll do the opposite. <laughs> Make you more resentful and angry. What is that? I think I missed something there. I don't know what that was. I think I, oh, that's this tape they use on the suit. The truth. The truth is, I love you. I have no fear. I couldn't survive. Hmm? I don't know what that was about. The mayor and judicial are going to grant me an exemption. <sighs> Why would they do that? They want to use me for something. But once you became sheriff and you started to look into Wilkins' death... I outlived my usefulness. You became a mortal threat to our survival. To our survival? Hopefully he explains how. So why don't you just tell people that it's okay to go outside? And how about the door, the massive door made out of steel at the bottom of the silo that George found? Why don't you tell people about that? Huh? Uh, she shouldn't have said that. I don't think he knew about that. It's time we both dressed for the occasion. Oh, Congratulations, by the way. You've attracted the largest crowd we've ever had. I was really hoping he was going to explain some stuff. I won't clean. Nobody intends to, but they always do. As the founders and their wisdom knew they would. I don't know why she would clean. She said she was not going to. Because she already knows the outside is the way it is. And she knows that cleaning it won't do anything. Maybe she'll destroy the camera on the outside. That'll be interesting. If I was there, I wouldn't be put on the seat. I think she's got something up her sleeve. Otherwise she wouldn't be out here. So I don't know what her meeting is with the other lady was about. We do not know why everything outside the silo is as it is. We do not know when it will be safe to go outside. She's got to know more than everybody else. 
So I hope I know what he knew this episode. On behalf of all the people of the silo, I hope you will clean so that we will see the world outside our sanctuary as it is. For some reason, I think she's either going to destroy the camera or everybody's going to be able to see what the outside really looks like somehow. See, I'm not sure if those bodies are there in that picture. I can't see them. The sheriff and his wife. Maybe she's going to mess with the camera. Okay, she's just going to clean. Do the same thing everybody else does. And doesn't do anything. The rocks. Those rocks are... What? I'm guessing none of that's real. And that's just like generated on the screen. Yes, he's just standing there. What? She knows. Knows what? What the hell? Very confused at the moment. So they are dead. Is what she's seen an illusion to? Good and supply. So she was properly taped up. They used proper tape so she wouldn't get poisoned. Illusion. That's what they used to force them to clean. To trick them. So it really is poisoned outside. <laughs> that was a twist I didn't see coming. She's got to find her way back in there somehow. Really is destroyed outside. What's she gonna do now? She's she gonna end up dying out there anyway. Even if she's got the proper tape in to stop the poison. They gotta be other silos. They're very close to each other. Very close. The silo, that area looks small for what the silo looks like. Inside. And they seem very close to each other. Surely they're doing in the mines would run into each other. In the mines. Unless they just mine downwards, but. Why did they build the silos so close to each other? We know there's at least 18, but there's might be way more than that. 
let's open for a bit more answers for the silo and its origins and its history. I guess we're going to have to wait till next season. That's probably when a lot of things are going to go down next season. A lot of information is going to be found out. Just hoping this show gets in the second season so I can find out. I'm going to be very annoyed if they don't make a second season to this show. I know they got the books, so I can find out that way, but I'm not much of a reader. But hopefully it gets renewed and I'll be back here watching. But yeah, guys, that's it for me for this season. It's been a pretty good first season. Just wish there was a little bit more answers about the silo, but we'll get them next season, as long as they make a new season. So thanks for watching and joining me as I go through the first season of Silo. Remember, if you made it this far, give this video a like, comment down below and subscribe, and check out my reactions for the upcoming shows I've got coming out. And I'll see you around. Bye.